new season for this team. If you look at your rotation yourself, Gomber, Quantrill, Hudson, a lot of guys who've done some things in the past, how much of a rebound do you want this to be for the Rockies? Um, yeah, I think we definitely need a rebound year after a 100-loss season. Um, I believe you know every, every club that has been in a situation like this is, is looking to have a, a good bounce-back year um, with all involved. I think you know adding uh, you know Cal and Dakota to our starting rotation with uh, Marky and Senza being out for quite some time, I think are great additions for us. Um, like I said, you know, since we since we signed them, uh, they're both guys who have established themselves in the big leagues, have had success in the big leagues, and uh, are looking to continue to have success. So we're excited to have them part of our crew. In a way, is it kind of motivating guys like that that they, they're coming off injuries? You know, a lot of people are coming off different things to kind of get in the camp with a little bit of, I guess, motivation. In. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm sure there's a ton of motivation for them. You know, signing with a new team, being in a new clubhouse, um, both, like you said, coming off coming off injuries. Um, I'm sure that they're chomping at the bit to, you know, get back and, and start competing again. Um, and those are the kind of guys that we want that are, you know, hungry to take the baseball every fifth day. So I'm excited to see them on the mound competing and uh, be right there along with them. You and I have talked about it. How hungry are you to get out there and show who Kyle Freeland is? Uh, quite. Um, after, like I said, after, after a bad year, last year all around um it's definitely uh chomping at the bit time trying to uh get uh, hitters in the box and start competing and uh and get back to the to the starting rotation that we want to be um so yeah i mean being really excited seeing these guys in this clubhouse day one uh we're ready to go uh, beyond the the first four and obviously there's competition for the fifth spot not a whole lot of big league experience, but a lot of guys got some last year. I mean, do you expect th this to feel like a deeper rotation? I, I believe so. Um, you know, not not just rotation, but bullpen as well. Um, the amount of pitchers that we used last year, a lot of guys were able to get their feet wet um, and kind of get comfortable in the big leagues of how you know things operate on a day to day basis at that high level. Um, so I think you know having all these younger guys that don't have a ton of experience in the big leagues, but they do have experience, I think is going to work in their favor and our favor, where they're not out there debuting. Or early in early in the season, not knowing what to do, they're going to feel comfortable in their shoes. So that's uh, that's definitely something that you know we're we're happy to see and happy to know that we're going to have. Last thing for me, we've talked about you evolving as a pitcher, developing a different changeup, um, the the one seam fastball. How much do you feel like a veteran because you're expected to be one? Yeah, you know, you, you got to continue to learn this game. Um, you know, picking up little things, trying different things, whether they work or not. Um, you, you always got to try and let your mind work in this game and and learn new skills learn new talents in this game if you're able to do that you're going to continue to be able to evolve your game um and i, th I think that's that's always really smart for all of us to be reminded of is to continue to learn this game because it, it can only help you if you do thanks man i appreciate yep. it all right Absolutely. Thank you. um here in here in big league camp obviously of, around the big league players how much are you looking to impress and how much are you looking to just do what you do he says this is the premier annual Aquí en, en este club con las grandes ligas, ¿qué estás uh, esperando? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo piensas mejorar y enseñar tu, lo que puedes hacer? No, primeramente, gracias a Dios, eh, mejorar, coger la experiencia de todos estos peloteros que están alrededor con mucha experiencia sobre, sobre mí, o sea que tiene más veteranía y aprender de cada uno de ellos y tratar de tener un buen Billy Camp. Uh, yeah, you know, first of all, I got to thank God, you know, just to give me this opportunity. Uh, but my main goal is just to, you know, learn from the veterans, learn from the clubhouse, you know, guys that have been around and just show that I can, you know, I can kind of help and, and learn in any way possible. Um, last season, you did quite well in Spokane, had the hand thing, and then you probably weren't totally healthy in double A. How do you assess your 2009? 23 season. Dice que te, te lastimaste, uh, tuviste un buen año, pero con tu mano te lastimaste. ¿Cómo, cómo piensas mejorar y cómo, uh, cómo hiciste el año pasado? Eh, trabajar en la pequeña cosa que me mantenga el cuerpo mío ready la temporada entera, full time, eh, y sobre todo agarrarme a la mano de Dios y tener un año saludable, que es lo que necesitamos. Yeah, you know, uh, just to work on the little things, you know, just, just stay healthy. Um, last year, you know, it's learning, big learning opportunity. Um, but, you know, again, just staying healthy and, and making sure that I'm on the field full time. Um, obviously, going against Major League pitching here in spring training. How excited is that for you to kind of test and see how you do as a switch hitter against some of the best? Dice como switch hitter estás enfrentando de pitchers de la Grande Liga, de cómo te sientes enfrentando de y la oportunidad de ser como switch hitter y enfrentándote con pitchers que están que son buenos.
a la, no, a la hora en punto que me toca enfrentarlo, tratar de dar lo mejor de mí, como siempre lo he venido haciendo. Eh, y se siente bien porque tú puedes cambiar de mano y sentirte cómodo a la derecha, puedes sentirte cómodo a la azul y lo importante es que yo me siento bien. Uh, honestly, you know, just uh, opportunity to face those guys and show them what I can do. Uh, you know, being a switch hitter, you know, I, I feel comfortable righty, I feel comfortable lefty, and given the opportunity to face those guys, I look forward to it. Uh, um, there's a big event coming up, the spring breakout, where a lot of the prospects play in it. Understand that they've talked to you about it. How exciting will that be in front of maybe a big TV audience and um, a lot of interest in baseball? He's like, uh, esta temporada o en Spring Training va a tener un juego con todos los prospectos. Dicen que a lo mejor ya te han dicho de ese juego. ¿Cómo te sientes jugar en ese juego y afrontándote enfrente de la televisión, enfrente de mucha gente? Se siente bien, se siente bien, que es lo importante. Y sobre todo el mismo juego, no importa con, con quién estemos enfrentándonos todo eso, pero en verdad se va a sentir bien porque son muchos mucho talentos peloteros jóvenes que van. Yeah, I feel, I feel great and I feel great, uh, you know, it's it's a big opportunity facing, you know, great talent like that, but it's like any other game for me, you know, you go out there and you show what you can do, but it's exciting to, to face guys that, you know, potentially are really talented players. Hey, thank you very much. Hey, can I have you? Okay, vamos.